Illinois lawmakers, citizens, and law enforcement continue to take action against the state's new assault bans. Now, you may remember the law bans the sale and distribution of assault weapons in the state. Those opposed say it's unconstitutional. News 10's Madison Zaleski talked with people today who say they want the law overturned and they are not backing down. That's right, Patrice and Rondrell. Today, a state representative, local sheriffs, and everyday citizens met in Crawford County to stand against the ban. They say it's against their Second Amendment right. I don't think it's really enforceable. Uh, it's something over the top, uh, and I think it will be repealed. Don Boyd is a gun owner in Illinois. He feels the state already has measures to make sure a gun doesn't fall into the wrong hands, like background checks. Three-day waiting period, you're, you have a national instant check. Uh, I'm a Federal Farms licensed dealer, and I've been doing this for 40 years. And I've never had anyone over the thousands of guns sold commit a crime. Crawford County Sheriff William Rutan is one of many sheriffs who says he will not enforce this law. Rather than a gun problem, he says our society has a huge mental health and drug problem. Combination of drug and, and um, you know, people being held responsible for their actions. Um, we need to enforce the laws that we have. In response to local sheriffs not enforcing this new law, Governor J.B. Pritzker says his stance on this issue continues to remain unchanged. He stands behind his previous statement saying anyone who advocates for law, order, and public safety and then refuses to follow the law is in violation of their oath of office. Instead of adding more laws and regulations, Rutan says it's important to properly prosecute those who break the law. Patrice, Rondrell, back to you.